Ladies and gentlemen, I want to start today with a story, a simple story about a young boy and a tree. This boy had a favorite spot, a giant oak tree he would visit every day without fail. Rain or shine, he was there. His friends asked, why do you visit that tree every day? He replied, because it's there, it's strong, it doesn't move, and it doesn't give up. Now, that might seem a bit strange, talking about a tree like it's a person, but there's a profound lesson in this. That tree, steadfast and unyielding, is a lot like life. It stands firm, rooted deep into the earth, facing storms, winds, and the scorching sun. Yet it stands tall, never faltering. That's the essence of our theme today. I will not stop. Let me tell you, life is a bit like that oak tree. Okay? It gives us storms. It gives us sunshine. And it tests our resolve with every passing season. But here's the secret. Secret just like that tree. Oak tree. <laughs> we have the incredible ability to stand tall, to persevere, and to keep going no matter what life throws at us. The power of perseverance, the unwavering commitment to keep going, is what we're going to explore today. Now I know, in this room, we have people from all walks of life. Some of you might be going through tough times, facing challenges that seem insurmountable. Others might be riding on the crest of a wave, enjoying success and prosperity. But no matter where you are in your journey, there's one common thread that binds us all. The relentless, unyielding spirit that whispers in our ear, I will not stop. You see, the journey to success, to fulfillment, isn't a straight line. It's a winding path with EPs and downs, highs and lows. But what makes the difference? What separates those who achieve their dreams from those who don't is the ability to keep going, to stay the course when everything seems against you. It's about having that unwavering commitment, a resolve that says, no matter what, I will not stop. We'll explore not just this, why? Well, I'm not stopping, but the how. How do you keep going when the odds are stacked against you? How do you maintain your resolve in the face of adversity? How do you build the resilience to keep pushing forward even when every fiber of your being wants to give up? Remember, the oak tree doesn't grow strong and mighty in a day. It weathers storms and droughts. It faces challenges that would make any lesser tree falter. Yet, it stands tall, a testament to endurance and strength. That's the spirit we aim to nurture within ourselves, the spirit of resilience, of perseverance, and of unstoppable will. A journey of discovery, of learning, and of empowerment. Let us explore the depths of our resolve and find that unyielding spirit within each of us. The spirit that says, I will not stop. The spirit that makes all the difference. Let's begin this journey, and let's begin it now. The bedrock principle of unwavering commitment. It's the cornerstone on which great achievements are built, the unshakable foundation of success. In life, just like in nature, the strength of our commitment is what keeps us rooted, strong, and able to weather any storm. There's an old saying, there's a difference between interest and commitment. When you're interested in doing something, you do it only when it's convenient. When you're committed to something, you accept no excuses, only results. This, my friends, is a profound truth. Interest is fleeting. It's like the morning dew here for a moment and then gone with the first ray of sunlight. Commitment, on the other hand, is like the deep roots of our oak tree, steadfast and enduring. Think of the great achievements in history, the towering successes that have stood the test of time. Behind each one of them, you'll find individuals who exemplified the never give up attitude. They faced setbacks. Yes, they encountered obstacles, of course. But did they let these stop them? Never, because their commitment was stronger than any challenge they faced. Let me tell you about a man I once knew. He started with a simple idea, a vision that seemed unattainable to many. 
He faced ridicule. He faced rejection. He faced the crushing weight of doubt, not just from others, but from within. Yet, he didn't stop. Why? Why? Because he was committed. His commitment turned a simple idea into a reality that transformed not just his life, but the lives of countless others. It was not his talent alone, not his circumstances, but his unwavering commitment that carved his path to success. Now you might say, that's all well and good, but I'm not like him. My challenges are different. And you're right, your challenges are different. Your path is unique. But the principle of commitment applies universally. Whether you're an entrepreneur, a teacher, a parent, or a student, commitment is the key that unlocks the door to achievement. So how do we cultivate this unwavering commitment? First, it starts with a clear vision of what you want to achieve. Without a destination in mind, how can you commit to the journey? You need a target, a dream, a goal that stirs your soul and ignites your passion. Okay. Once you have that vision, commitment becomes the force that drives you forward that keeps you moving when the path gets tough. But remember, commitment isn't just about the big life-changing decisions. It's also about the small everyday choices we make. It's about choosing to get up an hour earlier to work on your dream. It's about choosing to keep learning and growing, even when you feel like you've hit a plateau. It's about choosing to stay the course, even when a shortcut seems tempting. In the journey of life, there will be times when your commitment is tested. You'll face moments of doubt, moments of fear, moments when giving up seems like the easiest option. In those moments, remind yourself of why you started. Remind yourself of your vision, your dream, your goal. Remember that tree standing tall and strong, not because it's easy, but because it's committed to reaching for the sky no matter what. Keep this principle of unwavering commitment at the forefront of our minds. Let it be the guide that leads us through the challenges and setbacks, the discipline and consistency, and the vision and goal setting we'll explore. With unwavering commitment as our foundation, let's step boldly into the part of our journey, overcoming challenges and setbacks. Because my friends, it's not just about having the strength to go on. It's about having the commitment to start and the resolve to never ever stop. Together? with commitment as our unwavering guide. Let's navigate through the often turbulent waters of challenges and setbacks. It's a voyage we all must undertake. In the grand tapestry of life, these threads, though seemingly rough and discordant, are essential in creating a masterpiece of success and achievement. Consider the common setbacks we all face. A missed opportunity, a business venture that didn't pan out, a goal that seems to keep slipping away. These aren't just random misfortunes. They are the universe's way of teaching us, testing us, and preparing us for what's to come. Just as a sailor learns more in a storm than in calm seas, we learn more from our setbacks than our successes. But the critical factor here isn't the setbacks themselves. It's how we respond to them. It's not what happens to us, but what happens in us that makes the difference. When faced with failure, some people choose to stop. They see it as the end of their journey. But others, those with the resilience and tenacity that marks true success, choose to keep going. They understand that failure is not a permanent state, but a temporary situation from which valuable lessons can be gleaned. Learning from failures, not being defined by them, is the hallmark of a successful individual. When we fail, it's easy to get mired in self-doubt and recrimination. But what if we viewed failure as a teacher, a guide? What if we asked, what can this experience teach me? Instead of letting it define us, we can use it to refine our strategies, our approach, and our mindset. Now, how do we maintain momentum during these tough times? The first step is to embrace the power of reflection. After a setback, instead of rushing to action, pause and reflect. 
This reflection time allows us to gain perspective to see where we might have gone astray and to plan our next steps wisely. Next, we must be willing to adjust our approach. Doing the same thing over and over and expecting a different result is a path to frustration, not success. Sometimes a slight change in approach, a small pivot, can open up new avenues and opportunities we hadn't even considered. Maintaining a positive attitude is also crucial. Our attitude in the face of adversity can be our greatest asset or our biggest liability. A positive attitude fosters resilience, opens our minds to new possibilities, and attracts support from those around us. It's the beacon that guides us through the fog of discouragement. In tough times, it's also vital to seek support and inspiration. No man is an island, and in our journey towards success, we need the support, wisdom, and encouragement of others. Surround yourself with people who believe in you, who encourage you, and who challenge you to be your best. Read books, listen to talks, attend seminars, immerse yourself in environments that fuel your spirit and strengthen your resolve. But perhaps most importantly, we must keep our vision clear, okay? In the midst of challenges, it's easy to lose sight of our goals. Keep your vision front and center. Let it be the lighthouse that guides your way forward. When your vision is clear, the strategies, the actions, and the solutions will follow. Embrace the power of consistency. Success isn't built on what we do occasionally, but on what we do consistently? Yeah. Even when it's hard, even when progress seems slow, keep taking action. Remember, the grandest oak in the forest once started as a tiny acorn that held its ground. Let's take these lessons with us. Let them be the compass that guides us through the uncharted territories of discipline and consistency. For it's in mastering these that we unlock the true potential of our aspirations and dreams. Our path may be strewn with challenges, but with each step, we grow stronger, wiser, and more capable. Fortified by the lessons of our setbacks, and with our eyes set firmly on the horizon of our dreams. As we forge ahead in our exploration of the elements of success, let's turn our attention to the critical roles of discipline and consistency. These are not just words, not just uh, words, okay, but powerful tools that can shape our lives and destinies. In the tapestry of achievement, discipline, and consistency are the threads that hold the pattern together, ensuring that the final design is not only complete but also beautiful. The significance of daily disciplines cannot be overstated. It's the small, consistent efforts, the daily actions that lead to major achievements. Just as a river carves through rock, not by force, but by persistence, our consistent actions carve the path to our successes. It's the compound effect of these daily disciplines that creates the momentum needed to achieve great things. Let's talk about the power of these small, consistent efforts. Imagine a scenario where you decide to read just 10 pages of a good book every day. 10 pages might not seem like much, but over a year, that's 3,650 pages. That's a wealth of knowledge, insight, and inspiration gained from a simple, consistent habit. Or consider the act of saving a small amount of money each day. Over time, this discipline can grow into a significant nest egg, a testament to the power of consistency. I recall a personal anecdote that perfectly illustrates this point. Many years ago, I decided to start a routine of walking every morning. At first, it was challenging. The temptation to hit the snooze button was strong, but I persisted. Day after day, regardless of the weather I walked, this simple discipline, repeated daily, not only improved my physical health, but also cleared my mind and sparked creativity. It was during these walks that some of my best ideas came to me, ideas 
that significantly impacted my career and personal life. But how does one develop and maintain these disciplines? It starts with a decision, a commitment to yourself that you will do what's necessary to achieve your goals. It requires setting clear, achievable objectives and breaking them down into daily actions. It's about making a promise to yourself and then having the integrity to keep it. The beauty of discipline and consistency lies in their universality. They apply to every aspect of life, whether it's personal development, professional growth, health, relationships, or financial success. By applying these principles, you turn the ordinary into the extraordinary, transforming the mundane into the magnificent. However, let's not confuse discipline with rigidity. Discipline is about creating a structure that supports your goals, but it must be flexible enough to adapt to life's inevitable changes and challenges. It's about creating a rhythm, a consistent pattern that aligns with your deepest values and aspirations. As we weave the fabric of our lives, let's ensure that the threads of discipline and consistency are strong and vibrant. Let them be the forces that drive us towards our goals, that keep us on track when distractions and temptations abound. With discipline and consistency as our steadfast companions, we can navigate the journey of life with confidence and purpose. Let's focus on the pivotal role vision and goal setting in the quest for success. It's like setting sail across a vast ocean. Your vision is your destination, the distant shore you seek, while your goals are the navigation points guiding your course through the waters of life. Without a clear vision and well-defined goals, it's like sailing without a compass or a map. You might catch favorable winds, but where will they take you? A clear vision gives you a sense of direction, a purpose that drives you forward. It's the guiding star on the darkest night that keeps your journey aligned with your deepest aspiration. But this vision must be more than just a dream. It must be coupled with actionable, realistic goals. These goals are the stepping stones that lead to the realization of your vision. They turn the intangible into the tangible, the dream into reality. Let's consider the role of realistic, achievable goals. It's crucial to set goals that challenge and stretch you, yet are within the realm of possibility. Setting overly ambitious goals can lead to frustration and discouragement, like trying to leap across a chasm in a single bound. But setting goals that are too easy is like never testing the strength of your wings. The art lies in finding that balance, Goal goals that are big enough to inspire you, yet attainable enough to motivate you. I remember a time in my life when I set a goal to write a book. The vision was clear, to share my knowledge and experience with others. But the task seemed daunting. So I broke it down into smaller goals, writing a chapter outline, then a page a day, then a chapter a week. These smaller goals were my navigation points, and they led me to the completion of the book. This process taught me the power of breaking down a grand vision into manageable goals. Balancing ambition with practicality is an essential skill in goal setting. Ambition drives us to reach for the stars, to stretch beyond our comfort zones. But practicality keeps our feet on the ground, ensuring that our goals are grounded in reality. It's about dreaming big, but starting small, about reaching far, but building a solid foundation. In setting and pursuing goals, there are a few principles to keep in mind. First, write down your goals. There's power in putting your goals on paper. It's a commitment, a declaration of intent. Second, set deadlines. A goal without a deadline is just a wish. Deadlines create a sense of urgency and accountability. Third, review and adjust your goals regularly. Life is dynamic and your goals should be too. They should evolve as you grow and as circumstances. As we near the end of our exploration today, let's remember the importance of vision and goal setting in our journey of perseverance. Your vision is the beacon that lights your way and your goals are the steps that take you to that beacon. With a clear vision and well-defined goals, you can navigate the complexities of life 
with purpose and clarity. Take a moment to reflect on the journey we've embarked upon. We've traversed the landscape of self-improvement and personal development, exploring the essential elements that forge the path to success. We've delved into the heart of unwavering commitment, the fortitude to overcome challenges and setbacks, the transformative power of discipline and consistency, and the guiding light of a clear vision and well-defined goals. Remember, the journey to achievement is not a sprint, it's a marathon. It's a journey that demands commitment, a deep unwavering dedication to your cause. This commitment is the anchor that holds you steady in the tumultuous seas of life's challenges. It's what keeps you grounded when the winds of doubt and fear try to unsettle you. In overcoming challenges, recall the resilience of the oak tree standing firm against the storms. Your journey, too, will have its storms, its moments of doubt and despair. But like the oak, you have the strength to withstand them, to learn from them, and to emerge stronger. Every setback, every obstacle is an opportunity to grow, to refine, and to get one step closer to your dreams. The roles of discipline and consistency in this journey cannot be overstated. They are the engines that propel you forward, the daily practices that turn your dreams into realities. Like the artist who adds brushstroke upon brushstroke to create a masterpiece, your daily disciplines are the small, consistent actions that build the life you desire. And let us not forget the power of a clear vision and well-defined goals. They are the compass and map on your journey, guiding you towards your destination. Your vision is your why, the purpose that fuels your passion, while your goals are the steps you take to make that vision a reality. Now, as we stand at the crossroads, I urge you to embrace your journey with all its ups and downs. Embrace it with the courage of a warrior and the wisdom of a sage. The road to success is rarely a straight line. It's a winding path filled with lessons to be learned and victories to be earned. Never lose sight of your dreams, no matter the obstacles that stand in your way. Remember, the greatest achievements in life come not from the absence of difficulties, but from the perseverance through them. Your dreams are worth the effort worth the struggle, worth the journey. So, I challenge you today, not just to dream, but to do. Not just to plan, but to act. Not just to wish, but to commit. Your life is a canvas and you are the artist. Create a masterpiece. Be bold, be brave, and above all, be relentless in your pursuit of excellence. As we part ways, remember this. The journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step. Take that step today and then take another tomorrow and every day after that. Your future is not just a matter of chance. It's a matter of choice. Choose to be extraordinary. Choose to be exceptional. Choose to never stop.